Okay, so in this video, I'll show you how to install WordPress on uh, your domain name uh, using the five minute famous five minute installation from WordPress. In the last video, you saw how to upload the files and how to extract it using the file manager. So now what we are going to do is we're going to install the, the uh, install WordPress on our domain name. So first of all, what you need to do is you need to end, go to your uh, the domain name. you need to type in your domain name. So the domain name that I've installed uh, this blog on is I, I am successadvice.com. So I click enter the domain name and it'll straight away take you to this page, which is basically the, the preliminary configuration page. So you can select whichever language you want and you click on continue. It will take you to the next page where it will say that uh, you need to install. You need this information handy and uh, you once that is done, we should be able to go about installing WordPress. So we click on let's go here and it will take us to the first page. Now here you need to enter the details of the domain, the database that you saved in uh, in, in the last video when we created the, the database. So we are copying the name of the database and we will enter that here. We'll then copy the username and enter that here. And finally, we'll copy the, the password and enter that in this place. This should ideally remain localhost because most of uh, the servers, the database host remains the same, which is localhost. So once that is done, just click on submit and your WordPress blog should be able to install. So you click on run the install and that's it so here you can just enter a few of the details like for example the name of your site so here my the name of my site is i am success advice so i'll enter that here you can enter any uh, username out here let me just enter some random username and you can enter any password as well so let me uh, generate a password So this is a password. I copy and paste that here. You can enter your email out here. You need to keep this checked. Otherwise, what will happen is the search engines will not index your site because this when if you keep this unchecked, uh, there will be a file that is called as robot dot text in your uh, in, in your in the root of your domain so there uh, there will be a code that will be added which will prevent the search engines from indexing your website so once you've checked this click on install wordpress and your wordpress blog should be ready that's it so you see here your wordpress blog is ready now you can go and log in Let's try logging into the domain. So we've successfully installed WordPress on our blog on our domain name and we've logged into our dashboard. 